In my last video I made an orchid mantis farm, which produced around 150k bells an hour. After posting it somebody on reddit wrote, why not do the same thing, but with hybrids and farm peacock butterflies instead? You cannot scare them away, and they are worth more. So I tried that. Setting this up was somewhat similar to the last farm I made. I started by planting a lot of white flowers. Peacock butterflies are attracted to blue, black and purple hybrid flowers. I chose a combination of mums and pansies. To create these hybrids, place them in a grid pattern like this and water them every day. Once you have a few hybrids, be sure to plant these in a grid pattern next to each other and water them. Hybrid flowers will produce the same hybrid version of that flower every time. This way you do not need to water all of the white flowers every day and you produce hybrids way more effectively. When I had about 20 or so hybrids, I started planting them around my island in a big circle. I thought that it would help to spawn the butterflies faster. Unfortunately that was not the case. After 10 minutes I only got 5 peacock butterflies, which would roughly mean 30 butterflies an hour. That would only give me 75k bells. But after I realized it was not going to work like this, I decided to plant the flowers next to each other and make 2 patches. This had a significant impact. I tried this method for 1 hour and managed to catch 50 peacock butterflies which translates to 125k an hour. This might seem like a useless method, but I only focus on the peacock butterflies. I could have easily earned more by also catching other bugs as well. Sometimes I had to wait for a minute or two, so I ran to my orchid mantis farm to catch some extra bugs. I was extremely lucky the day I recorded this video because Flick was visiting my island. Flick bought all of my peacock butterflies for 150% of the retail price. So in the end, I made 187k bells per hour on peacock butterflies alone. This is a great method, but I think it can be better the more hybrids you can plant on your island, which I will try in the future. 